All right, this gun I was using today, I'm gonna to throw it in the ultrasonic cleaner and I'll show you how um, this will be all nice and shiny again when it's done. Um, this ultrasonic cleaner, this is the temperature setting. And uh, when I turn it on, this number is gonna go up until it hits 45 degrees Celsius. I wish it would be Fahrenheit, but it is what it is. Then I can set the uh, cleaner to however many minutes I want. So I set my temperature at 45 Celsius, 30 minutes. So once this hits 45 or close, then I can turn the ultrasonic cleaner on and then uh, it'll do its job. <clears throat> so uh, I just reuse this cleaner this cleaner is actually pretty dirty. It's got quite a bit of paint in it now, so I should probably change it. Um, what I'm using here is Envirolax cleaner mixed with water. So I dilute it by about 50% uh, or more. So I think I started with about 50% water, 50% Envirolax cleaner. Um, I did add a little more water to it. It still seems to clean well. Um, it is pretty gunky now. The last stuff that I washed, I actually ended up getting a good bit of paint in here. So I'm probably going to have to change it out. But I'm going to try it out and see how this works. Um, the other thing you can use is uh, just simply crud cutter or some kind of, you know, commercial cleaner like that. Or industrial strength cleaner. Crud cutter or um, awesome orange or totally awesome. I think it's called. I tried that. This is the one. I get it from uh, Lowe's. It's called um, Totally Awesome, another little word, Ayla's or something, Totally Awesome. And it is a concentrate, so you, I, I do mix this with water, about 50%. I actually like that stuff a lot. Um, the thing with the Envirolac cleaner, if you don't dilute it or you leave your gun in too long, you'll actually take off the shine off your gun it'll actually eat into it that much um so i don't leave it in for about more than 30 minutes what i'm going to do is just break this gun down a little bit and put it in the basket let the needle right in there just like that um i'll pop, we'll pop this little gasket off okay, i'm going to let that in there um take this top off yet let it clean out inside there All right, so all these pieces, I'm just going to throw them right into the cleaner in the basket. It is heating up now. It's getting pretty hot. Get this in there. So you want it to just, you know, just cover your gun. Put the lid on it. Um, it's a 39. It's probably good enough. I'm going to start it. I'm going to hit on. And then it makes this uh, like shrill noise that I don't like. Kind of hard on the ears. Alright, I will show you in about 30 minutes what happens when I take everything out. Alright, it's been 30 minutes and the machine shut off. Um, the heat turned off. So um, now we'll just take everything out. And I'll show you what I do from here. Let's take out the whole basket. Get yourself a couple paper towels. I like this nylon bristle brush. So as you see, the stuff it is like loose on here now. So this will just come right off with the brush. Um, it'll actually work with a rag too. This stuff will just, just come right off. I'm trying to hold my phone and wipe at the same time so it's not working real well. Get back in the corners a little bit with this brush. You want to clean out good inside here too if there's anything in there.
Okay, so nice and shiny again.